internet! Welcome back to Breath of the Wild Master Mode. As loyal viewers will probably notice, my audio is not clipping. Yay! Yay! Can I put a sound effect of Beatles saying yay? Please. <laughs> Alright, new recording session. Slightly new setup. Everything's fixed. I've tested everything this time before recording. So, let's hope nothing else goes horribly, horribly wrong. Let's get back into it. If I remember correctly, we are home. Even though he doesn't actually own it, the house yet. It showed it, it on the loading thing there. I know. Where am I? I also what just finished barkers? editing it. Where am I going? Um, you don't oh, have any... Oh, okay? right. Um, you were heading up to Zora Domain to get Ruta and then to the volcano. I think I'd rather do the volcano first, to be honest. But it's further away. Also, Mifa's Grace. I feel like I should activate something up in here. I'm probably going to climb through there. Maybe activate a shrine or something. Yeah, you probably should be hitting some more shrines. Because uh, you've kind of just been going from one tower to another. Yeah, that's because they're good starting points in the areas. They make it easy to come back and get shrines. Which is great, but... We... Hi, lady. I'm sorry? Hey. Just push... Will you stop attacking everybody in the village? No. Talk to her. She wants to talk to you. I wonder... I want to know if she'll attack me with her broom. Obviously she won't. She's not a guard. Morning. <laughs> she just wanted to tell you about the shop, really? Yeah. Useless NPCs. Why do you think I was attacking her? I knew what she wanted. There was something you could pick up there, you know. Huh? Don't worry about it. Just keep going. That was an oddly delayed. Wait, go take a picture of that broom? I right, know. Did you take a picture of the meteor rod? Not with that. Weird at that angle. I think it was a bird. Rivali's gale is now ready. Speaking of birds, Ravioli's gale is now ready. Oh, you know what's funny? Uh, while editing some of these episodes, I've used so many different ravioli references. I've got like five different I'm ravioli to stop raining. images. In the folder. <coughs> Good. Because I've got... Well, I've got Rivali himself, of course. I've got the ravioli can. I've got the word ravioli. I do actually have a single ravioli that I don't think I've used anywhere. Sounds like you need to use one. Oh, I'm sure I will. That grass. When the time is right. 
Quick. Come on, Rain. You're play, so close to being done. Play the reverse song of time. All right. Let me get a blade of grass. I like how we just combine Breath of the Wild, Majora's Mask, and Twilight Princess. You're welcome. Ah, God, I love Zelda. Obligatory, this game is beautiful. It is. Just look at those rain effects. I think I've said that at least one in every recording session we've done of this. Alright. Right there. Right here. You're still wet. <laughs> you are. So you're just gonna Revali scale anyways. Well, I need to Ooh, climb a bit rocks. regardless. That's Sparkly why I was rocks. waiting for the rain to start. Or, stop. <laughs> start. Stop. Whatever. Because I knew I would need to climb regardless. Bar. Lighting change just looked really weird. I know, right? Welcome to snow. I forgot it was snowy up here. Which is fine, because I'm not really staying up here. It's okay, you're wearing warm clothes anyways. Yeah, I guess I am. I noticed the uh, temperature gauge. Bye, Foxy. Wait, I didn't know we were playing FNAF. Is it just the one I'm leaving? It's just the one I'm leaving. Here we go. That one's yeah. kind of a tricky one. Anyways, so we're playing The Legend of Five Nights at Zelda's. Yeah, let's go with it. I don't know, somebody's probably made a Zelda based FNAF fan game. That was I, I would definitely play that, by the way. You're going in the water. I know. You should have used the Wind Waker first. <laughs> See, that bothers me. When he climbs out of the water like that, he's dripping wet. Shouldn't it be slippery? You would think. Just because he's wet. So, fun fact for you, uh, this is going to be the first time for Breath of the Wild that Monday's episode and Friday's episode are going to be different recording sessions. Yeah, I guess it is, isn't it? Uh, it we would have had this before except for that one Friday where, for whatever reason, the upload didn't want to go. Yeah. But that worked out really well because then we got pairs of episodes that went really well. Mm, that's not worth wasting a ravioli on. And then last time, we just ended on an odd number. Oh. That's the thing about this, is since each episode is a different length, it's, uh, it's hard to judge how many episodes we have per session. Sorry if this is getting too meta. I mean, you never know how much stuff you're going to cut from it, for one thing. I try not to cut much, if anything. And if you're not cutting stuff, how much you're going to speed things up. I, I will occasionally fast forward when we're just, like, you know, traveling somewhere and not talking much. Which is something I try to avoid doing when recording. Yeah, kind of like now, except we're talking now. Exactly. Like, if we weren't having this conversation, then I would be doing the thing that this conversation is about. 
It's yeah. kind of an ironic twist, isn't it? Mm, I'll go all the way up. Why are we climbing this mountain? It's a good jumping point. You could turn your shrine sensor back on. No, Doo -doo. thank you. Did I ever turn it off? <laughs> huh? Did I ever turn it off? I don't remember. Yeah. I think you turned it off, if I remember, somewhere around the I time guess, you hit Twin Peaks. I guess it hasn't been going off. Rock. Yeah. That's one of my favorite quick moments. Boop. Speaking of fast forwarding, uh, early on you were climbing a mountain <sighs> and I was fast forwarding because... That, that looks amazing from up here. See? This game is beautiful. This is why we came up here. <laughs> right? It's a tower there. You this should mark that. Why. Yeah. I think you've already that's... marked that one, but that's not the point. That's the way I'm going. <clears throat> There's two towers there. Yeah. Seriously, though, this game is beautiful. Look at that water from up here, too. No, right? The light refraction on that. Yeah, it's beautiful. Is that a cave down there? I think there's a shrine in there. Whatever. Keep going. <laughs> Just, like, stop and float down slowly. Anyway, so we were fast-forwarding because you were doing a long travel bit. Um, I want to say it's like episode six or seven, I think. I'll correct myself later. And you're just speeding along, and it stops, and I'm like, rock. And you're like, huh? Turn around, there's just a rock sitting there with a Korok under it. Yeah. And it was just... It was funny, because it's like, fast forward, fast forward, fast forward, rock! It kind of reminds me of Stanley Parable. When we're interrupting the adventure line. <laughs> yes. Wait. Go back and look at that fern. <laughs> I love the Stanley Parable. One of those. Was I going for the yellow, right? Yeah. Yeah. God, how many other games are we going to reference in this one episode? Couldn't tell ya. Because we've already referenced uh, three other Zelda games, Five Nights at Freddy's, Stanley Parable. Oh. Is that a Korok or a ghost? I believe that's a Korok. I think I remember this area. Yeah, that's a Korok. It's hard to tell at a distance. Because the uh I, I expected ghost, to chase him chase him more here. When the Wizros are invisible, they have a very similar effect. They do. Just run over, corner the fish. Yep. It's easy enough to do here. <laughs> mm-hmm jumps out of the water trying to avoid you. It's gonna zap you. Yeah, it might. It's gonna try. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it? Your spear's not electric. You mean oh. metal? Sneeze. Yeah, I'll pop that up there. Nope. Don't do it. Just let me be. Is it raining again? It's raining yes. again. Excuse you. <laughs> no, thank you. Just kill it. You don't want to deal with these guys, especially in the rain. A little more flat area. <laughs> really? <laughs> Alright. Did he just... Bail? Yes, he did. Really? Korok in this tree, isn't there? Possibly. I might have to climb it. Yep. Nope. What are you doing? Why did you go around that side? 
I wasn't trying to. Get up to. on that root. Never mind. Yep. Rock. Why do you always hit them? Because I can. You're so mean. It's the best.